Hey, what's going on everybody? This is G and I'm Funkin' Hungry. So this is another video that's sponsored by one of my subscribers. So I just want to say that I really appreciate it and thank you for the support. Now what they wanted me to review is the Tim Tam Deluxe range. Here we have all four of the Tim Tam Deluxe range. So we'll go through one at a time and I'll give my thoughts and opinion on each flavour and also which one I prefer. I'll leave the nutrition information on screen as I go through each flavour. So as I'm reviewing it, you'll see some text come up of the nutrition information and the ingredients. This is Tim Tam Deluxe Dark Choc Raspberry Tart flavor. So extra choc and extra gooey centers. So the difference from the normal Tim Tam range to the Deluxe, they have more chocolate and then they have these like gooey centers. So let's bust this open and give it a taste. Yeah, so that smells really nice actually. You get a really strong, raspberry smell and then you get that dark chocolate come through so yeah they're really strong tim tams normally smell nice and obviously taste nice but yeah you can see that these are quite heavy with the chocolate so it looks like there's obviously more chocolate than a normal tim tam it's quite heavy chocolate like almost like they've gone over it a couple of times with the chocolate so i do have my cup of tea here because you can't really have a biscuit without a cup of tea right all right cheers Ah, sipping tea like Kermit. So I'll try and eat this before it melts all in my hand. Yeah, so it's sort of like your normal Tim Tam. It's obviously got the chocolate around the chocolate biscuit and then like a chocolate cream in the center. Flavor is the raspberry tart, which I haven't quite got to. I taste a little bit, but it's mainly in the center, obviously. So I have another bite. So there's actually not as much raspberry as I thought there would be in this. Like you can taste it. You can't really see it though. It's quite a thin little layer of raspberry. But you can definitely taste it. But I kind of like that it's not too overpowering. Like you can really taste the chocolate, the chocolate biscuit, the chocolate cream. And then obviously you get that nice sort of ripe raspberry, a bit of sourness and sweetness come through. So it's not too bad. Uh, so I can taste and see it a little bit more now. Maybe one side just had a little bit more than the other. But yeah... Overall, not bad. Tim Tam Deluxe Dark Chocolate Raspberry Tart. I'd give that a good 6 out of 10. It's pretty nice. It's basically, you can taste all the chocolate still. So as you eat it, you definitely taste the chocolate biscuit. But then when you start getting into that center more and more, you get that sweet and that sour tart raspberry flavor come through, which is pretty nice actually. But obviously dark chocolate and raspberry is a little bit of a classic sort of combination. Just the dark chocolate being a little bit bitter and the raspberry being a bit sour, tart, and obviously sweet as well. They just seem to work really well together. All right, now another classic combination is dark chocolate and mint. So we'll bust this open and we'll have a look. So yeah, these definitely have a lot of chocolate on it. This one's warping a little bit. You probably can't really see it on camera, but you know, it doesn't have its like symmetrical shape. It's starting to sort of bulge out a little bit. All that chocolate. All right. You definitely know this is a dark chocolate mint. It smells like if anyone's ever had those after eight mints and stuff like that, you know, it's sort of like a classic flavor. All right, we'll break this open. So again, it has the chocolate on the outside, the coating, has the chocolate biscuit, and, and this one has that mint cream. You can see it's sort of like a white paste going through it. Now I do enjoy mint chocolate, but it's not one that I normally always grab off the shelf. You know, if I'm gonna grab one for myself, I'd grab a different flavor, but it's definitely one that I do enjoy every now and again. All right, cheers. Okay, so this one is funkin' delicious. Just a perfect combination. You get, you get that chocolate flavor come through. Now it doesn't really taste like dark chocolate, even the dark choc raspberry, not so much. Maybe it's just because obviously I'm used to other brands of dark chocolate. But yeah, perfect combination. You get that sweetness and that biscuit start coming through. But then it starts building up the mint. So at first you sort of get like a subtle mint flavor. And then it builds up and leaves that cooling sensation in your mouth. Almost like chili, you know, it slowly builds up and you get that cooling sensation. And it sort of coats the back of your mouth with that mint flavor. Definitely a perfect combination and definitely an awesome biscuit. So my rating for Tim Tam 
Deluxe Dark Chalk Mint. I'll give that a good 7.5 out of 10. Definitely better than a Dark Chalk Raspberry Tart flavour, which was still nice, but this one is definitely more sort of like a Moorish flavour. You definitely have it and you kind of want to keep them going. It's definitely delicious and yeah, definitely works together those combinations of flavours. Okay, so now we have one of my favourite combination of flavours, which is the Salted Caramel Brownie. Oh, I didn't actually know this was a Salted Caramel Brownie. I thought it was just Salted Caramel. So yeah, maybe the biscuit would be a little bit different inside. Who knows? But yeah, now I'm definitely hyped just having that brownie flavour. I'm normally more of a caramel fan than salted caramel, but you know, at the end of the day, it's just a little bit more salty. <laughs> so you can definitely tell this is milk chocolate instead of dark chocolate. Obviously, it's a lot more light in colour. So we'll bust this open and we'll have a look at this inside. Alright, so you can see that gooey caramel coming out. So the biscuit just looks like normal Tim Tam biscuits. It said it was brownie, but it doesn't really look no different to me. All right, cheers. Okay, so that one was pretty nice, but it's not the best caramel biscuit I've ever had. Like, it's okay, but yeah, for some reason the caramel gets a little bit lost, or it's just not really strong and rich and sort of but luscious sort of caramel. It's not bad, but I think I prefer the mint. So my rating for the Tim Tam Deluxe Salted Caramel Brownie Flavor I'll have to give that a 7 out of 10, because it's above the raspberry flavour, but it's below the mint flavour. Alright, so the last flavour we're going to try out of the Tim Tam Deluxe range is the Decadent Triple Chocolate flavour. So extra chocolate, extra gooey centre. So yeah, this sounds nice, so the, the centre is going to be chocolate as well. You have the biscuit that's chocolate, you have the coating that's chocolate, and then you have the inside that's going to be chocolate as well. So like a chocolate cream or whatever. All right, let's bust this open and give it a taste. Again, it's the milk chocolate, so you know it's a lighter color. But let's bust this open and have a look. Oh yeah, so the cream inside or the gooey center is chocolate. So yeah, you got the biscuit. See, the biscuit looks the same as the last one, but it said it was brownie, you know? But who knows? Hopefully this one tastes more like the classic Tim Tam, because I really like, you know, just original Tim Tams. White Tim Tams are really good as well. See, most Tim Tams are good, but you can't beat the original Tim Tam. So hopefully this is kind of like the original Tim Tam, just elevated a little bit more, like a hybrid of the original Tim Tam. Like they've just taken that original Tim Tam and just hulked it out and, you know, made it buff. Alright, cheers. Mmm. That one's good. So yeah, it doesn't really taste like an original Tim Tam, but that's okay because this is absolutely funkin' delicious. This one's really good. It just works so well. The other ones, you get that chocolate flavour, but then obviously it takes you in a different direction when you start getting the centre. But this one, it's like you taste that chocolate flavour, and then you just keep on walking towards that chocolate flavour. It's just, you know, really good. And because of the chocolate cream, it just brings up that chocolate flavour even more. So yeah, this one's absolutely delicious. Loving this one. So yeah, that one's definitely my favourite. It just really works and just is perfect, really. So my rating for Tim Tam Deluxe Decadent Triple Choc Flavour, I'm going to have to give that a 9 out of 10. I definitely recommend. They're all delicious. But if I was to say just to get one, go the original because then as well if you're used to tim tams this one's a little bit more closer to what a tim tam is or the original tim tams even though with that chocolate center it definitely takes you on a different journey because normal tim tams have like a chocolate cream inside it just has that sort of rich chocolate flavor the cream is a different sort of flavor obviously it's a little bit more milky and it's just yeah a little bit more like a cream where this one is kind of like a chocolate sauce, if you know what I'm saying. Before I go, what would a Tim Tam review be without a Tim Tam Slam? So if you don't know what a Tim Tam Slam is, you bite one corner, then you bite the opposite corner, and you turn the Tim Tam into a straw. So you have to make sure the biscuit's revealed so it can soak up through the biscuit. It's going to be a little bit hard in this cup because it's a little bit low now, but... And then you have to eat it quick. Mmm. So that was the triple chocolate that I did the Tim Tam Slam with. And it's funny how different the flavour is. You know, it loses a little bit of that chocolate flavour. 
but also it just brings out another flavor. It's just delicious because it's all melted and gooey. It kind of combines into one. Like obviously you don't have the texture of the biscuit. It's, it's delicious, absolutely delicious. If you've never had a Tim Tam Slam, give it a try. I want to give a shout out again to the subscriber that sponsored this video and requested this video. I really appreciate it. If anyone else wants to sponsor and help fund the video, I'd really appreciate it. There's links in the description box below, so take a look. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, if you could please like, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss a video. This was G from Funkin' Hungry and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.